Welcome back to the UGF Pandas. We got another road game this week against the Duke Blue Devils, playing a lot of basketball schools in a row. Guess it's Hoop Nation time in the ACC. If only UGF had a good hoops team. Duke's lost five games this season. They beat Army, who's ranked, and they beat Virginia Tech, who's number 11 in the country. Not really sure how to feel about this team. They do have that A-minus defense but we're beating them in every single category statistically. Got another four-star recruit in last episode, Lionel Jones. He said this guy's a running back, 83 trucking, 74 break tackle, but he could also play defense if we wanted to put him there. This is getting emotional already. Our final home game for the seniors this season, including Will Horton, Jeff Warren, and many others, is gonna be against a top 10 Georgia team. Best ending we could possibly give them. Seriously, we dropped down to the seventh best class in the nation. Right now, we're in the driver's seat to take the ACC Coastal Division. We need Virginia Tech to lose either to Georgia Tech or Virginia, and then I think we've got this ACC Coastal Division locked up. Of course, that's assuming if we beat Duke this week. Jeff Warren and a lot of UGF seniors are going to be showered in awards this offseason. Hopefully, that should boost them to NFL status. There are still six undefeated teams so there's no way we're making the national championship. Interesting, Leon James, one of the prospects we're going for is visiting Duke this week. Can't throw any interceptions today. Do not want him to commit to Duke. Ooh, like those uniforms. Nice small stadium. It's almost like they prefer to play basketball around here. To be honest, this track around the field is very distracting. It's just all this empty space. Do like the background of the school though. Not that side, the one with the buildings. There you go. This is a team we should definitely beat. So let's get out on the right foot early and not get tackled for a loss. That's the opposite of what we wanted. Ronnie Reddick is open. Beautiful throw from Will Horton. Boy, I hope Leon James saw that blown coverage. Let's see if we can get him to blow it again. Got Daniel Sanders deep. Go. Wish he could have gone to the end zone. That's two big plays back to back for the Pandas. Oh, Will Horton broke a school record for passing yards in a career. I didn't even know he was close to that. Way to go, Will Horton. Yeah, keep that ball for sure. Daniel Sanders on the curl. Cannot power his way into the end zone, but he's got two big catches early on in this game. Only gonna run one route here, Daniel Sanders. To the corner. Too much contact from the defensive back. Fine, you wanted it this way. We're gonna go for the QB sneak. Will Horton's got it, had to spin his way in. But we got seven points. This crowd is so quiet. Please throw it my way. He's gonna test Connor Hoffman. First interception of his career. We got one block too, Sam Ramirez. That's all right, the con man. He's known as the headhunter, not a guy who gets interceptions. Way to go, big boy. Out of character, Jeff Warren has been trashed today. So, you know what that means. We gotta get Will Horton going in the passing game. Drag routes, we got a block, kind of from Jeff Warren. He just kinda, just kinda flailed his arms at the defender and he got him out of the way. Hit the running back. Cut up field, Jeff Warren. Oh, I wish he could've got around both of those guys. Streaking over on the left side. McDonald beat his man. Able to catch up to him before he can get a touchdown. Will Horton is dealing right now. 140 passing yards already. I have a feeling we're gonna break some kind of record today with Will Horton. Got McDonald over here, open again, trying to get him his touchdown. Getting closer to it. We got Jeff Warren open, touchdown Pandas. Quickly up 14-0. This might not be a contest today. I'd say it's been a good start, 14-0. Let's see if we can keep it going. Screen pass. Oh, we're shutting that down. No way that's gonna work. Barely had time to even blink. Threw it out of bounds. Hit as he threw it. Easy interception for Mike. Is this gonna be another repeat of the Pittsburgh game? I'd love to have one. Damon Harris over here on the left. Shoves him off. The freshman putting in work. Scrambling off with Will Horton. If I don't see anything, just take off. Good philosophy. Over the middle, Daniel Sanders. Beautiful touchdown number three for Will Horton and the UGF Pandas. 193 yards already in the first quarter. 
feel bad for Duke. They've they've already thrown two interceptions on their first two drives, and we're just gonna keep putting pressure on him. He's gonna go to the flats. That's all Eric Tyson. Not getting away from that. Another pass thrown out of bounds. Nothing's gonna be open for this quarterback. Oh, back-to-back -back plays just chucks it to the crowd. We've been locked down. Look at that UGF offense so far. Unbelievable numbers, and we're still in the first quarter. Just gonna throw it in there. Damon Harris grabs it. This one's to the tight end, Ronnie Reddick. Ooh. Usually breaks off at least one. Will Horton is playing with some mad confidence right now, already over 200 yards. Come back for that one, Daniel Sanders. That's amazing. That is some great communication between a quarterback and his receiver. Daniel Sanders, six yards away from 100 yards in the first quarter. I'm having so much fun picking apart this defense. Quickly throw that one, Daniel Sanders on the streak. This close to the end zone, that's just cheeky. 242 yards, three touchdowns, one quarter to do it. He finally gets a first down. Took him long enough. Sacked him. Sent both safeties on the blitz because I'm that confident in my defensive backs. Oh, he's going to test him deep. Eric Tyson got beat, but he's got the beautiful ankle tackle. Tried to bait him to get the interception, but now they got their biggest play of the day. Screen pass, not even going to get it off. Reggie Manning gets his second sack of the game. That is not open. Nothing's open. He's going to try to run. Will Smith's going to boom him. Surprised he didn't fumble it there. They make the field goal. One big play let up, and they already put points on the board. But it's still not close. We got a 25-point lead. There you go, Jeff Warren. Finally, some positive yardage on the ground. There you go. Everybody's getting receptions today. That's what I'm talking about, Damon Harris. The step back cheese. I'm surprised he didn't go for a touchdown there. That was awesome. Dylan Brown gets the reception, gets the first down. Even the fullback is catching passes out here today. Keeper for Will Horton cuts in, touchdown. He has been part of every single touchdown today. Will Horton takes back his career rushing touchdown number from Jeff Warren with that one. They're like battling each other to see who can take it. They don't run the ball very much, do they? Oh, pfft. turn around. Second interception of the game for Mike. Third one for the team. And the crowd's booing him. They know this game is long over. Wide open. Damon Harris bobbles it. Doo -doo. Wanted a touchdown. Wanted that one play touchdown. Well, they are blitzing and they're blitzing hard and I just trip on my own running back and fall over. That's embarrassing. We're going to give Daniel Sanders a chance over here with the safety hitting him. Oh, just waited too long for Daniel Sanders to get open. Let's get some of that back on the ground. Jeff Warren breaks off one, as he does. At eh, third and 14, I know we can get this. Over the middle, one-handed, Sam McDonald. This is so much freaking fun. Everyone's balling out today in the receiving game. Screen pass, Daniel Sanders, go, go, go. Got it. Broke a school record for receiving touchdowns in a game and we're still in the first half. Will Horton, 344 yards. Four touchdowns. This is incredible. Quarterback's taken off. Boomed him with Reggie Manning. He's going to think twice about doing that again. Somebody strip this man. No way he caught that one. I thought we had that dude blanketed. Ooh, that should have been Reggie Manning's. Sitting on that one. Ooh, Mike almost got his third interception of the game. You want to keep testing him, quarterback? Please. Oh, running back dropped it, got scared. 
Does he have a guy open? Eric Tyson deflects this one. Third and goal. No one is open. Oh, except for that guy. Just chilling on that other sideline. No way I was going to catch up to that guy. Well, just two seconds left. Time for a Hail Mary bomb. Oh, we got Jeff Warren open. Fastest guy on our team. And he still can't outrun their safeties. That's disappointing. But I'll take a free 49 yards for Will Horton. 42 to 10 at halftime. The boos are strong in this one. <laughs> Get there, Mike, anybody? Dang it, he just floated that one up. How did we not pick that one off? Screen pass, get there, Eddie Foster. Excellent, another tackle for loss for the defense. Another post route, Montgomery catch up to him. Almost a touchdown. We're starting to slip up a bit, not like it matters too much. Run up the middle, we got Eric Tyson. Option play, Will Smith's not gonna get thrown off against the quarterback. <laughs> they're booing hard in the crowd. Surprise there's still fans here. Third and goal, Jeff Warren gets his first interception of the season. That'll be nice for the Heisman stats. Dragging the toes at the one yard line too. I didn't even realize Jeff Warren was in the game with that last one, but okay. I will accept. And a six yard run to get us out of danger too. If we've somehow pulled this off the Wildcat. Jeff Warren, he's got the block. Get around those last couple dudes, dang it. I wanted to go all the way. I want that 99 yard touchdown. My goodness, that was horribly overthrown. Will Horton, you've been great all game until that pass. Oh yeah, Daniel Sanders keeps bailing me out. Can we get him 200 receiving yards in this game? That would be a crazy achievement. Scrambling with Will Horton. We got a ton of space over here. Tackle from behind, but not before I get 15 on the ground with the quarterback. Got Damon Harris on the corner route. What the heck? He just kind of stopped there for a minute. Will Horton's closing in on 500 passing yards. We've shown no signs of stopping. Like, they just do not have a good pass defense. Let's throw it to the running back here. First down. What the? Oops. Let's try that play one more time. <laughs> we got the tight end. Touchdown. Five passing touchdowns this game. Tying a school record for Will Horton. 462 passing yards. We're not stopping yet. We're gonna keep going until we have all the records. Oh crap, Eric Tyson got beat again. That one was user error by me. Moved him slightly to the left and he couldn't recover. Oh, he threw that one way too quickly. Sam Ramirez has got this one. And I think we've got a few blocks. If 85 wasn't so dang fast, though, it would have been a pick six. Five interceptions for the defense in this game. Deep downfield. This one almost picked off by the safety. They've had chances to intercept Will Horton, but they just can't come down with it. We got Sam McDonald. No one's covering him. What are they doing? Another touchdown for Horton. Broke a school record for passing yards in a game. 504. Six touchdowns. The record is now his. Can you believe all of this? And we're still in the third quarter. Boy, I'm sure they're ready to hit the reset button. We're finally gonna run the ball. The reason we have so many points is because they just keep forcing passes, we get interceptions, and then they just keep passing it so the clock slows down. They've passed it 32 times, only run it seven. <laughs> Zach Nash bamboozle him from the corner. He's going for it. Eric Tyson gets one. Six picks for this defense. That one was horribly forced by that quarterback. Why is he still in the game, honestly? No, Drew, please don't pass it again. This game's already over, but I want to. I gotta break all the NCAA records. Daniel Sanders on the comeback route. This just looks so easy. It's like we're in practice mode. These guys cannot cover our receivers. 
Tight end. A little Ronnie Reddick action. Oh my goodness. That is just some beast mode stuff right there. Surprised that screen pass got as many yards as it did. And I'm not complaining. Oh my goodness, I got hit and fumbled it. Didn't see that one coming. Now with six minutes left in the game, they get a turnover. Oh, hit him again. Forced the fumble, Marcus Kendrick's got it. They forced the turnover, we just get another one right back. That's seven total turnovers on the game for our defense. There's Jeff Warren's big play. On a day where Will Horton's just tearing it up, Jeff Warren's been kind of quiet. Here we go. Back-to-back -back first downs for Jeff Warren. Oh my goodness! No way! Oh, I'm, sur I'm not surprised he fumbled it. He broke three tackles before getting there. Another turnover for us. We're just kind of messing around, honestly. That's a hell of a catch by that guy. The guy's got a 11 catches, 170 receiving yards. It's a shame his team's down by 46 points, so it's not going to really mean much. He's open. Eric Tyson, another great ankle tackle. I don't even know how that's possible, man. That's amazing stuff. Whoa, couldn't get past the block. They get another touchdown. I'm almost happy for them. I mean, their confidence has to be low after this beatdown. <laughs> another first down. We're calling a timeout, too. We're scumbags. Over here, Daniel Sanders again. One yard short of the end zone. Timeout. We got the fullback open and no, no surprise he drops it. <laughs> I don't know for sure, but I think seven touchdowns is a record. Will Horton has six right now. That one hits the ground. We got two more chances at it. I'm not quitting on it. Screen pass, Daniel Sanders. Another touchdown for him. That's seven on the game. They're mega booing us now as we put up 60 on Duke. Now Daniel Sanders has the record for receiving touchdowns in a game officially with four. <laughs> we are just pulling him. There's like no time left on the clock, but we're still like massively hit sticking him. He's throwing it my way again. Oh, come on, Eric Tyson. Could have been a walk-off pick. This game's finally over. Man, it was a long one, but that was really fun. Record setting for a ton of guys for the Pandas on offense and defense. It's not even close. That's Will Horton's career game. 235.9 QB rating, 584 yards, seven touchdowns. But he doesn't stop there. He also got two touchdowns on the ground. He accounted for nine total touchdowns in this game. Every single one we had was from Will Horton. <laughs> Jeff Ward, 94 yards on the ground, pretty good for him. Look at all these receiving yards. Daniel Sanders, 200 yards, four touchdowns. Jeff Warren, 122 and a touchdown. Sam McDonald, 118 and a touchdown. Damon Harris, 74. And then Tavares Lyles got a touchdown too. Eric Tyson led us in tackles with nine, two of those for loss, one pick. We had a total of, what, six interceptions on the game? And Jeff Warren, who came in the game for a couple of snaps, managed to get an interception, the first one of the season. That was incredibly fun. We got 690 yards of total offense. They had nine rushing yards and 407 passing yards. Seems like they're a one-dimensional team. <laughs> I love these headlines. Humiliation. UGF takes the Blue Devils to the woodshed. We got the most anticipated game ever versus number seven Georgia, our rivals in the Adama Dome to keep the streak alive. Will Horton and all the seniors final home game ever for the UGF Bandits. It's gonna be very sentimental. I think it deserves its own episode. Heck yeah, Greg Nelson. Welcome to the Pandas. Glad you committed to the team. Oh, look at all this XP finalist for the Heisman, finalist for the Thorpe and all these other dang awards. So much XP, school record for passing touchdowns in a game, passing yards in a game, receiving touchdowns in a game, NCAA player of the week, 
My goodness, if Tony Romo wasn't upgraded after this, I don't know what. Ah, Georgia lost their last game. So now they're number 12 and we're number 15. Unbelievable, we're near 300 points short of upgrading Tony Romo again after all of those upgrades. Just one more week and we're there. Jeff Warren has been at the top of the Heisman watch for ages now. If he doesn't win it, then it's a complete disrespect to him. He's done it all, man. He's played offense. He's played defense. He's got an interception, tackles for loss, you name it. Oh, Virginia Tech lost last week, so that means we are a lock for the ACC Conference Championship. And that means we will play the undefeated Florida State Seminoles. This could not be any cooler, guys. It doesn't matter what happens against Georgia. A lot of big episodes on the way. And there he is, Will Horton, getting NCAA Player of the Week. What a stat line. Don't think anyone's going to be able to top that this season. We're still projected for that Chick-fil-A Bowl against Alabama. I'm very afraid to play Alabama. Go ahead, welcome Greg Nelson to the team, the wide receiver who can't catch. I mean, he's got great spec catch and route running, so maybe in a couple seasons he'll be fantastic. Moved up a spot, now we have the sixth best class in the nation. Won't rest until we have the best in the country. Checking out the stat leaders, Will Horton, 11th in the country in passing yards. Rushing leaders, Jeff Warren is 6th. Receiving leaders, Daniel Sanders is now 25th. Tackle leaders, Eric Tyson, well above the pack, and so are a ton of pandas. Sack leaders, Reggie Manning, our safety is number 4. Interception leader, Sam Ramirez, is still at the top with 8. Senior day, Will Horton, Jeff Warren, and everybody else who's contributed over many years here at UGF. It will be their final home game in the Adama Dome to protect the streak. Next episode, we get to find out the Heisman winner, all the award winners, and then we have this epic matchup against Georgia. It doesn't get bigger than this, guys, where Kirk Herbstreet is still doubting us. We love being the underdogs, Kirk. You should know this by now. That's pretty much all I have for this video. Cannot wait for next episode. Hope you guys are as excited as I am. Anyways, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. You're all legends in my book, and that's for me. I am Drew Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace. Got the tight end. Diving catch, Ronnie Rennick. The growth of this kid has been phenomenal.